Welcome back to the channel everyone. My name is Garrett. This is Grizzly Reviews. I have to get used to calling it Grizzly Reviews after the rebranding. It is not Coalition of Friends anymore. It is Grizzly Reviews. So last year I got into making videos again very late into the season. I went to Spirit Halloween. I could only find a few good things which are the three things you see up there. They're really good signs. I enjoy them a lot because I knew I was going to make more videos in the Halloween season that I wanted to make sure I got to spirit early enough to get good things so I could, you know, have good things to display. So I spent a little too much money than I should have, but I'm really proud of everything that I have. And with some help of some people, um, this was gifted to me by Patrick. Thank you, Patrick. Big thank you to the people that were helping me out with this stuff. Um, and let's get into my spirit Halloween haul. We're gonna start with the thing that is the only non-Halloween thing I got, which is this mug. And it's a Ted Lasso Believe mug. It's so cute, I love Ted Lasso. It's a pretty big mug, so it'll be good for hot chocolate. And I just want season three of Ted Lasso to come now, so I can use this and watch it and um, drink some nasty English tea because tea is gross, as is sparkling water. So says Ted. Moving right along, I got a Friday the 13th little um, cup, you know, um, tumbler, I think they're called. It's cute, I love that it's Jason, and it's all like the hockey print, which will match the next thing I show you. I like this a lot. This will be fun to have my normal drinks in when I watch horror movies this October. And I definitely will be having that cup every time I wear this hockey jersey. I really wanted to get this last year, but they were all sold out and I didn't want to like dig through too much um, online to try and find it. So I'm glad I was there early enough this year to get it. I'm glad they continued making it. It's now my second hockey jersey that I can wear as an adult. My other one is a Chicago Blackhawks Corey Crawford jersey. And then I really want to get a Carter Verhage one from the Florida Panthers. You'll see this again later this month, I bet, probably. Okay, so we see the three signs I have up there. I found one wooden sign this year that I really love. It is this Friday the 13th one. I have to put it right here, so it hopefully will stay in frame all of it. Um, it is every version of Jason throughout all his movies. So this won't have Pamela Voorhees on here. I won't have the killer in Friday the 13th part five, even though you do see a Jason in that movie. I don't know if his mess is on here, but this is still all of the Jasons from before. It pairs really well considering I have Shout Factory's complete collection of the Friday the 13th movies. So I am really loving, I really love this. It's super fun. There is one decoration I got that will not be any videos outside of this one because it is for the floor. It is this Halloween doormat. Welcome, have a nice day. And then it has the, the poster from the first Halloween movie on it, which is really why I wanted it, because it had the poster and it wasn't just like Michael Myers. It's the theme of it. And it has like the, the Halloween printing as the welcome. And then, you know, I just really like this a lot. I think it is a perfect little doormat um, for, you know, Halloween and it's a little joke. As soon as I saw it, I wanted to get it. And I'm really happy I did. Okay, I have been on the hunt for some quality home decor for my walls for a long time. I don't really have anything on my apartment walls right now. Would love to get some disc plates. That would be really fun to have and just I'd be able to like switch them out really easily. But on this trip to Spirit Halloween, I found three canvas prints that I really, really enjoyed. There was a Pennywise one. I am not the biggest It fan or Stephen King rather. Um, I have seen both It movies. I plan to own them at some point. Pennywise isn't like one of those iconic horror villains, you know, he really only has one mini series on the television and then the two movies. And I just, I didn't feel like it was necessary for me to have them. So I got the big three of them. I got Freddy, this is Freddy's. I really love how it looks. I love how not total in your face it is with it being Freddy Krueger. His finger knives are what's the important thing and that's what's scary about him. And I just love how this print looks. And then I have a Jason one, which I think I just realized got scratched. 
at some point, um, which is okay. It's not a bother to me. You know, my um, Strava Factory collection has a scratch on it, so I'm not too worried about it. It kind of goes with Jason, you know, he just slashed it. Um, I really like that it's a hockey mask. Jason's is really cool, but this is not my favorite of them all. My favorite of the print is gonna be this one of Mr. Michael Myers. I love the Halloween franchise so much. Of the three that I've shown you, Halloween is my favorite. I think it has the most fun kills. It has the most engaging characters. It makes the most sense as a movie franchise that it's just a dude killing people. It's not like Jason that has all this like, you know, coming back to life stuff and everything, or Freddy's rules that don't make sense ever. His mask just is so scary. I think they did it justice on here. The last thing I got from Spirit Halloween, Scream is my favorite horror franchise. I love all five of the movies. I think they're all really good. Although I do have some that I don't like as much. Two and four are my least favorites of them all. The new one I absolutely loved. Um, someday I'll get to making a review on each of them. But for now, I don't have any decorations for them and I'm so sad about it. So I found something that was a must have to grab and it's this ghost face resin bobblehead figure. And it's adorable and I have to, I gotta open it up. I recently found Pentatonix's um, Happy Now, um, no, the Lucky Ones album and I can't keep um, Happy Now out of my head. It's a very good song. Oh, this is a lot smaller than I thought it was. It's not buyer's remorse, but I'm just like, um, okay, what happened? Oh, wow, it's heavy. <gasps> His little ghost face. He's adorable. People who make decorations, don't make me have to cut someone's neck. Look at him, he's so cute. <gasps> Look at his little bobbling head. Oh my God, oh my God. I'm gonna set him up here. Cause that's a lot of fun. Um, so yeah, that concludes my Spirit Halloween haul of 2022. I am getting no more decorations for this season. Maybe a few um, like drapery things just to make this more spooky -er. But on the whole, I'm really happy with what I got. I'm really excited to now put it all up because we're getting into that October season. It is October 1st today, the day that I'm posting this, and I'm just so excited for it to be Halloween season. I'm, I'm pumped. I'm so pumped. Halloween ends comes in two weeks. I think Hellraiser comes out this month too, um, the Hulu reboot, remake of it. So yeah, lots to be excited for for Halloween in October. Thank you for watching this video. If you liked it, please give a like. If you want to see more of my videos, please hit subscribe. All these movies that I just mentioned, I will do reviews on this month. So please subscribe if you want to be notified when those are coming out. And I'll see you all in the next video. Bye-bye. Just take another look at that bobbling head. Isn't that so much fun? This little bobbling head. We'll see if it's in focus or not. But also that ASMR. Oh my god, I'm in love. Oh, <laughs> you're so adorable.